spotlighting heroes every month through our News 2 Gives Back Hometown Hero Spotlight. It's all presented by Trevecca Nazarene University. As Sylvia Castaneda shows us, this month's hero is a nonprofit doing life changing work to help people leaving prison. Check it out. In 2020, Alex Davila was released after serving 23 years in the Illinois Department of Corrections. Not only did I get released out of prison, but I got released in the middle of the pandemic. And it was like many places were closed. Many uh, places were not willing to give me a chance. It was frustrating because at that time I, I was applying for jobs everywhere, going to multiple interviews, and I was not getting past the background question. That changed when Alex walked into Project Return in Nashville. That once I met the people and they didn't talk down to me and they understood where I was coming from, and it just it meant the world. This nonprofit was founded in 1979 by Reverends Bill Barnes and Don Beiswinger as they saw the overwhelming obstacles facing people leaving prison. Our mission, our goal is to work with individuals who are recently released from incarceration to provide employment opportunities um, and wraparound services so that they not only get a job, but they maintain a job and are able to grow into their employment. So as soon as somebody is released from incarceration, they can come into Project Return and start our job readiness classes. And in there, you will really learn just the basics of interviewing, getting back in the workforce, applying for jobs, um, and just really how to present yourself. Once you also complete our job readiness classes, you are eligible for our wraparound services, and that includes helping people get their IDs. Um, that's a process that we actually start uh, while somebody's going through class. We will help you create your resume. We will help you get your birth certificate, any of those documents that you need to get employment. Um, we will also help you with medical, dental exams. Um, so being able to provide that because we know that your medical health also impacts your performance and just your quality of life. Participants can even take courses like this one on construction readiness. Project Return also provides things like clothing and shoes for a job interview or a new job, tools to do that job to a bus pass to get them to work. Because when you go to work, it's not just about showing up, but it's about showing up prepared as well. Job coaching continues even after someone is employed to help them grow in their job. Project Return also has its own landscaping business that offers property maintenance, another way for participants to be employed and gain experience. Plus, Project Return partners with employers like Builder Supply Source in Madison, who are looking for good employees. We've been partnering with Project Return for about four years, and yeah, the, the people that we get are very motivated. Uh, they're looking for a second chance, so they're very hard workers. They're there on time. Uh, they're very dependable. So it's been a great experience for us. In 2022, Project Return's goal was to get 75% of those they serve in Nashville full-time employment. Project Return hit 80%. Staff also wanted to keep participants from returning to prison. Project Return's recidivism rate was only 12.5% when the national average exceeds 50%. Project Return is a hero in our community because they're taking people who need an opportunity to get back into civilization and get back to work and providing them a path to do so. Uh, they reach out to employers like myself and help us to get employees that we need and they're giving guys a second chance. As for Alex, he graduated with a bachelor's degree and was hired at Project Return, working his way up to education coordinator. Project Return is a hero to our community because we don't only just talk about it. We use inspirational words, of course, but we also act and you can't be heroic without actions. So we honor Project Return as our Knees 2 Gives Back Hometown Hero for the month of February, presented by Trevecca Nazarene University for its dedication to provide people returning to the community after incarceration the resources and services needed to gain employment and rebuild their lives. Project Return has recently opened an office in Chattanooga offering services there too. Mm, now, if you'd like to learn how to partner with Project Return, volunteer or donate to the nonprofit, visit projectreturninc.org. Local on 2 will be right back after this.